So guys, we're setting up at the NCIX Tech Fair. We're just doing like some last minute preparation before everything gets started. You can see the stage is set up. We're in Aberdeen Center here. And uh, we're gonna take you around and show you some of the booths that are in the process of getting ready to go. Remember, at Aberdeen Center Mall in Richmond, Saturday, Sunday, May the 12th and 13th. Come check it out during the day. For more information, you can visit www.ncix.com and look for the info about the tech fair or ncix.dot.com on Facebook for more information. Asus is here as one of our platinum sponsors, so they're showing off a wide variety of different things, including gaming systems, monitors, motherboards, networking. Asus makes almost everything, so definitely you want to check that out. We're here at the Galaxy NVIDIA joint booth. They kind of pulled together and grabbed a few tables so that they could set up together. So they're going to have a couple really cool gaming setups. They're going to show 3D, large format, as well as got, they got some heaven benchmarks running here on a pretty cool game. So that's another thing you're going to want to make sure that you definitely come and check out. And there's also great prizes you can win. We've got tablets, TVs, Xbox, and a variety of other things. Over $10,000 in prizes to give away. But you do have to come out to the show and fill out one of these forms and put it in the old fishbowl in order to qualify. Here's the Samsung booth. Never one to be upstaged when it comes to awesome demos. So we're going to take a closer look at a couple of the things they have inside. Here at the Samsung booth, there's tons of cool stuff, including their new Series 9 Central Station Monitor. So this reduces the cable clutter at your desk as well as delivering their latest PLS panel technology in a super high resolution, glass, sleek looking front panel format. This looks like a beautiful monitor. As you guys know, I'm a huge fan of their existing PLS monitors, so it can only get better with time. We've also got a couple of Series 7 tablets. This one's running Windows 7 but they're actually going to have one set up running Windows 8 Preview as well, so you can take full advantage of the touchscreen capabilities of this tablet. They've got a wide variety of other stuff, including their latest TV technology, even some printers, and last but not least, about six notebooks that you can try out whatever you want, just check it out. So, see you there. Gigabyte boots pretty blinged up. I saw Antec sort of swing by here earlier putting their little LEDs on the table in order to dress things up a little bit as well as tidying up the cable management. You know, not that we're burning our, our Gigabyte guy here at the show on his tidy cabling, but you can see it looks pretty slick with everything all tied up nicely using nice cable extensions as well as the Antec 920 Cooler H2O with the sweet LED lighting effects. No IT show would be complete without AMD. They're showing off an iFinity setup running off of one of our gaming machines here. And they also have a bunch of other really cool stuff. So you can see sort of where we've come from in terms of video card technology and how much more advanced it is these days with the 7900 series. And they also have one thing that I think is pretty cool is a bit of a museum of AMD CPUs going all the way back to some pretty ancient stuff from back when AMD used to even share a socket with Intel. Now they've, uh, they've definitely come a long way from that as well. They've also got a wafer here showing how the CPUs actually come out of the manufacturing facility before they're packaged up like this. Corsair's got their wide portfolio of products on demo, including their peripherals, mice, keyboards, headsets, as well as cooling products, including my personal favorite pre-done liquid cooling unit, the H100. We've also got one of their newer cases on demo, so you can actually touch it, feel it, see how you like it. And uh, I don't see any RAM, but I think we're all pretty familiar with Corsair RAM at this point. BenQ, projectors and monitors. Don't forget they do both. They've got the GP2 here, their little pocket projector. This is one of the show deals where you can get it with the battery pack that runs for about four hours, which is pretty cool. They've also got a 3D Vision light boost ready monitor powered by him, an NCIX PC, one that we actually did a video about a little while ago. And Sony really brought everything. They brought, they pulled out all the stops with their PS Vita booth, so you can come here, check out the Vita. They built this whole thing in a matter of like an hour, so I didn't even manage to get footage of, of the actual setup. So they're just putting the finishing touches on it now. This is their latest handheld gaming system. I haven't actually used one yet, but hopefully I'll be able to sort of say something more intelligent about it a little bit later. Apparently I'm partying now. MSI and OCZ are back to back here. They're both going to have really cool demos of their respective technologies. So MSI, we're going to be putting together their test bench showing their one button OC Genie overclocking where you can try it and see how easy it is in real time. And OCZ has a live demo where they have two identical notebooks, each with a different storage setup. One with a Vertex 4 SSD and the other with a hard drive. So you can do the Pepsi challenge, so to speak, and try it to see whether you can tell the difference for yourself. 
last minute setup is the uh, definitely the domain of the NCIX PC team. We get things done no matter what. And you can see we've got our flagship i1 system here at the Intel booth with the GTX 690 running inside. Looks absolutely amazing. Let's go in and get a closer look at that. So remember guys, this is the carbon fiber wrap system that is pretty much balls to the walls, pre-overclocked, uh, Core i7 3770K GTX 690, and it doesn't get much faster than that. And last but not least, we don't believe an event like this would be complete without some pretty sweet deals. So we've got like sort of dim sum menu style, a bunch of the show deals that are available. There's actually a second page as well. So we're just gonna pan through these really quick. You can always pause if you really wanna read them. Don't forget, you have to be here at the Aberdeen Mall location in order to take advantage of these deals. And you can see that quite a few people have decided that they are interested in the deals and they want to come check out the fair as well.